Two years ago, the Cat's Eye News made a story about a Novi citizen who was in a predicament that most Novi residents couldn't even imagine. This man was detained in Russia back in 2018 on espionage charges. His name is Paul Whelan. I'm standing here at the Portsmouth apartment complex, just about a 10 minute drive north of the high school. This apartment complex here used to belong to Paul Whelan, a 52 year old Novi resident currently serving a 16 year sentence in a Russian work camp on counts of espionage. The 54 year old former U.S. Marine worked in security for American companies and traveled to Russia frequently, and at the time of his arrest worked for a local automotive parts manufacturer called Borg Warner. While traveling to Russia to attend a friend's wedding, he was detained by Russia's FSB after being accused of spying. He has been trapped there ever since. However, fortunately the saga has come to a happy ending, because in early August this year, there was a high-profile prisoner swap which facilitated Whelan's release, after over 2,000 days trapped in Russian prison. He was among 16 individuals from a range of countries who were exchanged for eight Russian prisoners, and what the BBC described as the biggest prisoner exchange between Russia and the West since the Cold War. Here is an interview that the CNN had with Whelan shortly after he landed in America. It, it didn't feel real until we were flying over England. I'm a British citizen, Irish citizen, Canadian, and American. So as we came over England and I looked down, um, you know, that's when it became real. We flew over Ireland, then Canada, and into America, and then I knew I was home. So getting off the plane, seeing the president, um, the vice president, that was nice. It was a good homecoming. So looking forward to seeing my family down here and just recuperating from five years, seven months, and five days of just absolute nonsense by the Russian government. Novi is happy to have you back, Paul. See you later, Novi.